Uh, but that, that's neither here or there. Here, we're just basically smacking people around. Um, you know, I, I remember there was, it was a fairly difficult start, a little bit of a challenge, but since then we've been running roughshod over the world, um, spreading our own unique brand of, of, of pacifism, I guess we could say. We're currently at war with Poland. Now, I'm not sure, it, did, did the war start because of her, or this emergency? I have to defend horse... H Horse 2K until the end of the emergency here uh, for 19 more turns. H Horse 2K is right here. And then I think, I don't know, we get a bunch of money or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A Bun bunch of things will happen. Anyway, um, overall, that's not proven to be too terribly difficult. We have been, uh, we've got kind of an awkward shaped territory. Like, you know, we're, we're really striking down here. Um, I'm trying to like, so this is the real, like, this is the Europe True Start location map. So I guess we're going through, over here, this would be going through the Balkans. We're heading towards Constantinople. Uh, Greece would be down here. Um, so yeah, we're, we got to head up here and polish off the rest of the Polish cities, perhaps. It's Pass from your Risky Band. Oh my god. If there's ever, I don't know if this is a thing you can do, because I know it's like, beer and wine. I mean, first of all, you can just homebrew that stuff. I mean, you can't homebrew whiskey or anything like that. But if I could make my own branded version of whiskey, I would totally just call it pacifism. Pacifism. 18-year-old pacifism or something like that. You know, the pacifism 18. Excellent. He enjoys recreational bike theft. Who dat? Bump, bump, bump. Oh, why do you look like a bike thief? <laughs> my hair's getting really long, so... I don't know, I just wanted to control it a bit. Also, I haven't shaved in several days, so this is an extra scruffy stream. You guys are, are seeing me at my, my perhaps my roughest, but that's okay. Anyway, I think there's nothing for us to do but to start hitting some buttons and seeing what we do and, uh, and otherwise, you know, smashing with Poland. I, you are interested in peace, which is interesting. Um... Oh, it's already in the list. It doesn't go out of the list. I see. You wouldn't give me Gdansk. I don't. I'm sure it's not pronounced that way. Really, you wouldn't give me any other cities. I mean, you'd probably give me all your gold. However much that is. I mean, we could just do that. Oh, not literally willing to give me all the gold. On the other hand, is there anything really stopping us from just smacking people around some more? Probably not. Uh, let's go and take a look at what our cities need. We've got Sharazrad over here. Uh, one turn of the loss. Are you shrinking in population? Oh, you are. You're currently starving. Eh. They're, they're my citizens. They should probably be used to starving. Here, we'll do the research lab. That's going to be fine. Occupied, no growth. Yeah, fine enough. You know what? We'll just get a granary going on for you. That's going to be okay. We'll repair the water mill over here. I think that was a city-state that was annoying us that we decided to just bop along the way. Um, these trade routes should really be sorted probably for, probably for production. I don't know. Yeah, just go to Brussels. It's kind of awesome. Uh, more trade routes. Go to Brussels. Everyone loves sending trade routes to Brussels. Brussels, of course, was the capital of France before we took it over. Let's just pretend. Uh, ooh, golf coursing. Yeah, we want more of that. Whiskey and chocolate. Whiskey and chocolate from Luke Reynolds. Thank you very much. Finally caught my first stream. Never heard of Sim 6 until I found... Hold on a sec. It's hard to read there, and this sounds like an interesting message that I want to read. I mean, they're all interesting messages I want to read, but this needs a little bit more squinting. Never heard of Civ 6 until I found your YouTube. Wow, uh, and now I've got it working my way through winning with every leader. Keep playing and I'll keep watching. Well, thank you very much, Lil K Reynolds. I, wow. Well, welcome to the world of civilization. And honestly, if you're enjoying Civ 6, there ain't nothing wrong with going back and trying Civ 5 and Civ 4 and things like that. They will be different, admittedly, but you might, you might find that to be some fun. All right, so if we want to smack a do some cities here. Whiskey and chocolate? From Gabook! Holy cannoli! Dude! During your PDX con, you mentioned that you were considering trying to teach Briar CK2, is that what it said? 
Yeah, I keep trying to convince him to do it. Uh, any use on that glorious idea? Also, please liberate all the chocolate can from Northern Europe. It's all melting away. Oh no! Is it? Wait. Like, are you saying in real life it's like really hot right now? Right now? I mean, I'm sure the chocolate isn't actually melting, but wow. Upgrade to drone. Oh, that's the balloon I can upgrade to a drone. I wonder what that does. Okay, let me let me address you in a second there, Gabook. Let me move these units around. Now, we don't have... You have a promotion available. Can attack after moving. So, no matter what, my turn's gonna end if I do the upgrade here. Um, so, I guess I'll move as far as I can. <sighs> this is what happens when you haven't played for a while. What I meant to say is, I'm gonna move one tile short of how much I can. GamerCat, thank you, I'll get right back to you in a second. What I meant to do is move one tile short of my maximum so then I could promote and not be an idiot. And the observation balloon has no movement either, so I cannot upgrade you to um, a drone. Oh, guys, we can't take breaks like this. What are we doing? Uh, let's go ahead and plunder that trade route. And see, this one I'm going to leave with a movement, and it's not going to matter because it doesn't have anything. Oh, but this one actually can shoot after moving. Does it already have that promotion? No. Did it just have enough movement in general? Oh, that's... No, that's artillery. This one's a field cannon. I don't know. Anyway, I'm going to move you around here. That's going to be fine. And we'll end this turn. We'll check those uh, whiskey and chocolate fund contributions. Uh, so you, oh, you can go and bop that guy. It doesn't kill him, but we'll bop him out of the way, and that's going to be fine. Uh, oh, you are having some uh, rebellion problems. Uh, so are you. Oh, I got to leave some units in some of those cities. Okay. You're going to get golf coursed. You're going to get some trade routes going to the Nod God, because that's quite a bit of production and food. And same thing with Narnak over here. Okay, before we go to the next turn, and before I lose track of things... Yeah, um, the CK2 thing. Yeah, uh, I really, really want to do a co-op CK2 with Barstone. I think it'll be hilarious. We're just having a hard time doing the scheduling thing. We're even having a hard time um, getting back together with everyone to do the next um, Stardew Valley multiplayer, although I think we're going to do it tomorrow morning. So cross your fingers. We'll hopefully get some more content for that soon. Uh, I think that'll be so much fun. I'm really dying for, um, dying for? Looking forward to... Dying of impatience for? I don't know. There's like a phrase I'm looking for. Um, the next CK2 expansion. Uh, because it looks like it's going to be fantastic and ton of, uh, tons of fun to play. So maybe that's how the time will work out. I don't know. So GamerCat, thank you very much as well for the contribution to the Whiskey and Chocolate Fund. Glad you're back with The Civ, my favorite game. This will be my last donation for a while as I lost my job last week. Oh, dude, I'm so sorry. Or dude or dudette. Dude in the generic sense. Uh, oh, that sucks. At least that, that means I get to watch the stream this week, right? <laughs> Have a drink some chocolate on me. Well, thank you very much, and I hope things turn around for you pretty quickly. My, my, my. Uh, and James, thank you as well. Hey, Quill, been watching YouTube, but never been able to catch a stream because of school. But I'm homesick. Uh, yay? So thanks for the entertainment. I'm, I'm glad you could be ill. Or something. <laughs> uh, to call you a thoughtless cur is an insult to curs. She thinks I'm a warmonger. What, just because I'm going around killing everyone? How dare you? Good day, ma'am. I said good day. Uh, things are being bombarded, but we're mostly okay. We took damage, but that's fine. Hey, Indy. Nuclear program. Excellent. I like to see that. Uh, let's repair some stuff. I don't even know why we have to repair over there. Do we have barbarian issues or something weird like that? I don't remember. So our neighborhood can be upgraded with either a food market, plus through food, or a shopping mall, which is a tourism booster. I don't care about the tourism. The food's really nice, though. Growing in cities is kind of excellent. So let's go ahead and do that. Um, green, white, night. You can probably just get a sewer or something. Hopefully you're not rebelling too soon. Um, here, we'll very slowly build a zoo over here. Apparently, we're going to bombard a very ancient Polish ship off the coast there. We'll go and start doing some farming over here. And I'm going to scoot backwards, so I'm at range of the city. Just kill that bombard. And then over here, you wait a second. 
You wait a second, because we can shoot you. And... So seriously, what happens if we upgrade you to a drone? Well, apparently we get a boost. Does drones just have more movement? Do they deliver Amazon packages? Plus one range and plus five bombard strength. Oh! Oh! So they add bombard strength. Oh, cool. All right. Anyway, even though we didn't have it on that one, that's going to be all right because we're just going to walk into the city and take that. Done, done. Keep city. Anything cool in the city. We'll do some renames soon, too. A couple of districts. That's it. That's all right. The right pronounce, pronounce of Trajan is Trajan? Trajan? Is it really? Hmm. Right, someone inside a partisan last stream. That's right, and they went around blowing some stuff up. Mm-hmm. Six months! Hey, thanks, Sarge! Da, 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 da. Glad you could be ill enough to not just fight going to work slash school, but not so ill as to prevent you from still enjoying the stream. There we go. I guess that is the right balance, uh, real luckless. Yeah. Da, 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 da. Nappy Bonaparte over here. Uh, just go ahead and build a monument, because we'll... And it's whiskey and chocolate! Uh, from Bob Dergoot with 666. Thank you very much. Here I am again. It's a donation haiku. I just like haikus. <laughs> My favorite uh, haiku is, um, haiku. Is it haikus are easy, but sometimes they don't make sense. Refrigerator. I'm not counting. I'm not counting the syllables. It's something like that. Is it writing haikus is easy, but sometimes they don't make sense. Refrigerator. The last two lines I got for sure. Entertains me. Da, 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 da. All right, you get in there and chill to get rid of some of the unrestness. Unrestness is a perfectly cromulent word. All right, you wait there. You just go and displace Napoleon and go over there. We'll exile Napoleon. That that works real well. Uh, you, you have to wait here just to make sure to do some uh, some loyalty busting. Although since we've got more of these cities now, we're probably getting a little bit more loyalty production. But we will see. Mm. It's old Italian. Traiano. Whatever. We'll, we'll call him Traja. Just to be like crazy. They took our gerbs. Better to fight for something than live for nothing. Ah, do we have uranium? One. Okay. Uh, what do we have to do? Dismiss it and then click? Yeah. Two. Are you actually under the city? Oh yeah, because we're working it right away. That's amazing. Hookalord. Everyone in Hookalord has that certain glow about them. And they're, oh my God, we had no uranium in, uh, in, in Great Britain and Ireland. So it's a good thing that we've been expanding like crazy. All right, we'll have to send you. Come over here. You're gonna replace whatever's over there so that you can mine that. Um, spec Ops. Paratroopers and things. I mean, it doesn't really matter what we're researching right now. I suppose if we're going to continue down the total warfare point, you know what? It does matter what we're researching, because of course we're going to uh, we're going to get ourselves some nukes, boys and girls, and we can claim a great person. Who can we claim? What a surprise! It's a great general, Samori Toure. I don't know who this is. If someone can do a quick Wikipedia. That would be kind of interesting. Um, guess Twitch fixed the whole Prime sub desubscribe deal. I don't know. Did they? Did they, did they make it so it's easier to reset or something? Uh, anyway, we'll go ahead and grab you. Uh, common strength movement to modern atomic air tiles, or you can create a spec ops. Maybe we'll just do that. Because God knows I'm very poor at micromanaging my great generals and admirals and stuff like that. You built a field cannon? Doesn't feel like we really needed more military units, but sure. Uh, oh, we want more seaports, because we get all kinds of awesome stuff from seaport things. If I recall correctly. Aren't we? Anyway. Maybe it's the shipyard, actually, with the production boat. I don't know. Anyway, it's fine. We're going to keep going down that route. Boats are cool. Broadcast center? Sure, why not? I mean, if we have a district, we may as well get all the buildings for the district. Um, so, yeah, you come out to over here. I'm just going to go ahead and make you into a spec ops, even though it would make way more sense to keep you around as a great general. I just, I just want it. Uh, yeah, I guess you can keep running to here. Just repeat that route. That's okay. 
And I really don't know if we need the sealed cannon for anything, but we're probably going to have to make a push onto Rome. I, I suspect domination victory is the one that makes the most sense for us at this point. I mean, we could probably just go and, and science it. Can we? Do we have open borders with you? Really? All right. All right, so now we're into the thing where we almost, well, okay, let me move you first. And yeah, we're going to move you to here. And then promote you so that you can attack after moving. Excellent. And the drone was no longer linked to you, apparently. Oh, probably when I promoted you, it broke the linkage. Um, why don't you go ahead and just fortify until healed over here? You don't really have anything to shoot. The knight's going to stay there. We need oil to get, what, helicopter? Tanks! Mmm. Come over here and plunder trade route. Excellent. Not that we need the money. That's going to be all right. Uh, Quill's going for a domination win. What is this? Pacifist run? Yeah, I guess so. Again, you know, if there's no one left to fight you, then peace will reign forever. Uh, you're doing the thing where I can't just space bar you for some reason, which is very annoying. Uh, you're, you're right. You're healed. Now... You're becoming very loyal. I bet you. Yeah, we'd only be losing f the, this five. So our uh, loyalty would still be rising here if we left. So I'm going to go ahead and send you outwards. That's going to be okay. We're getting more cities, so we've got more loyalty. Uh, yeah, let's dig up whatever artifact is over there. Um, Harold Hardrada. Ooh, neat bracelet. There you go. We'll get you there. Done. Uh, apparently we have a Highlander way out over here doing some scoot in a boot. Can I not put you on auto explore? Too close to our tribal village. Oh, there is a tribal village, which gives us a builder unit. Well, that's swell. Let's instantly build a golf course. That's obviously a priority. And by golf course, of course, I mean whiskey distillery. <clears throat> it's been brilliant sunshine here for the last seven days. Nice dead mate. When uh, I left Scotland last, when I was there for a week, it was like 25 degrees, perfectly sunny every single day. It was crazy. Let others say what they will, but the real flourishing of the atomic era culture began with the rise of professional sports in Scotland. Football, football, football. All right. Uh, I love how he's like on a, I don't know, an Apple II or something here, and we're talking about professional sports. I guess he's playing a very early build of football manager. Football manager 1745. It's very popular. Uh, we could become communists. We've already got a boost towards it, but I mean We are running fascism. That's likely to continue to be the case uh, It does unlock a few new policies Including no wear wariness. You know what defense of the motherland? Oh, that's for combat in your own territory uh, Food from domestic trade routes actually would be pretty good and five-year plan Not bad. I you know, we'll just grab it. We got another great person who dis a great admiral sure and uh, go ahead and finish the seaport. Same thing here. Whatever, they're fun. And there. Build them all over the place. Stock exchange, a lot of money. Not that we're hurting on cash. In fact, we should probably be spending it for something. We've got some amenities issues in a few, few places. Uh, can I just purchase the food market here? It's whiskey and chocolate, whiskey and chocolate from Pinginator. Pinginator, thank you very much. I got a bunch of emails telling me my last two donations to the fund didn't stick. Time to rectify that. Yeah, there's with the new system, some people with certain types of PayPal accounts, a couple of things get bounced. Um, I hope I've resolved that now because that's kind of annoying. I mean, annoying to you and really bad for me, but I think we're mostly okay. We'll, we'll see how it goes. Um, yeah, let's build something new and exciting over here. Actually, let's, uh, let's buy some... Let's buy some tiles. I'm just going to, like, embiggen the land over here. Oh, I've spent all my money. <laughs> all right, maybe I shouldn't have gone so crazy. Um, not much point in having a harbor here. Why don't we just build a water park? I mean, there's not much point in having that either. But it's going to sound like fun, so we're going to do it. A little builder over here. I don't know if there's much or anything for us left to build on our homeland over here. This is one of the places that would be nice to have um, CQUI again. Uh, I don't know if we have the tech to exploit oil. We might, but I guess what I'm going to do is send you... I think I'm already sending someone here. Yeah, I am. 
Still, go in this vague direction. There's like lots of stuff that needs to be improved over here. This is where we need our builders. So we have a great admiral, Grace Hopper. Did Grace Hopper not have something to do with computers somehow? If I trigger her, we get a Eureka. So let's do that. Composites. Grace Hopper, something to do with computers, right? Debug those computers. <gasps> right, yes. Thank you very much. Mm -hmm. Thank you for your unit tutorials. Help me high school project. Out. Hey, awesome. I actually got an interesting email uh, yesterday asking about some info on callbacks and stuff like that. And for some reason, I thought I'd done a standalone video specifically focusing on callbacks. And apparently I didn't because I couldn't find one in my search. The closest I could find was like how to make a spell casting system or something. I think it would be great value to make a video specifically on callbacks and events and delegates um, for C sharp slash unity. So I don't know. We'll see. Can I work that if it's outside of my territory? I think so. Can't remember. I don't do a lot of archaeology. We're usually a little too busy um, at that stage in the game. Um, let's get the camp set up first. And... Highlanders can go and blow up the Barbarian over there. And my Spec Ops here actually has a promotion available. Oh, you get... um These are, are Scout-type promotions. All right, let's go Hills. Bloop, bloop. Resubs with Touch Prime. We got Larian, Gael. Thank you very much. Uh, just remember, you build single units, form your other units up into armies. Right. Yeah. Thank you. Boom. Uh, so, please link. Move up. Boom. Are we getting a wonder? No! Darn it! What is this? Mont Saint Michel? Yeah, it is. So that'll be the next city over. Uh, but we'll keep you anyway. And build me a monument. And how are we doing loyalty-wise in here? Do I actually still have to keep this unit here? We're rising at 5.2. So if I leave, then we should still rise at a tiny little rate. So, yeah, we'll go ahead and do that. So, singleton infantry over here. Doesn't have anyone to merge with over here. I don't know if we've got one sitting around somewhere else. You wait there. Uh, you wait there. I don't want you to get bombarded. Because you'll probably take too much damage. Alright, let's go. Bum, 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 bum. Domination most likely. Yeah, I think we'll keep going for it. Now, the tricky bit will be getting down to... Um, we need to figure out, like, Rome, and then Georgia's capital will be another thing. Because we've got French stuff. I guess we could check the ranking system temporarily here. First of all, we're leading in science. Hooray! 52 techs, which is three more than the person in second place. We're not leading in culture. But I don't think there's going to be a lot of Polish... Polish. Polish culture left after we, you know, take their last city. We're leading in domination, not a surprise. And religious victory, Poland is leading as well. But again, it is not entirely accurate. Um, yeah. Yeah. So domination, we've got five capitals. It doesn't tell you the outstanding ones. Now that's five capitals captured, plus our own. So there's only two missing, and that would be Rome and Georgia. Yeah. And a lot of people have been eliminated completely. The Netherlands had a really hard time this game. Our first taste of war was actually an emergency to, I think, defend or recapture a city for the Netherlands. And we got a bunch of money, and then they failed to keep it. And we're like, okay, then you, you stop existing now. Domination. Surprised me, because Quill isn't the kind of lad to get into a bunch of wars. <laughs> uh, uh, you're going to offer me tea. I mean, oh, you want a statue? No! I was going to say, yeah, like, when it was going to be something like four luxuries for one, like, fine, who cares? Who doesn't like tea? No, you can't have a gut! Stop asking for my statues! They're mine! <laughs> Ba -da 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 -da. Let's get a power plant. Let's get the 
Yeah, whatever. Get the seaport. It's fine. Get the factory. Sure. Get stock exchange. Excellent. Uh, repair your watermill. All right, you are going to mine some uranium, giving us a total of two. Well, I guess I gotta start the Manhattan pro- uh, no, I, I, 